Hello everyone, welcome back to my SDL2 tutorials and today we are going, I'm going to show you how to add audio into your SDL program or application. So what you're going to first off do is go download the SDL2 mixer package and you add that to your SDL folder in your C drive wherever you keep all SDL's core files and then what you want to do is go into your project and code blocks go into properties Projects build options, linker settings, and you want to add this minus lsdl2 underscore mixer and you click OK. And now you're going to start adding code. So, what you're going to want to do first is add the header for sdl mixer. So, you're going to include the sdl mixer h now what you're going to do is we're going to create the variables that will hold the music files and chunk files so mix underscore music and it's going to be a pointer so yes and we're going to set it to null we're also going to do one for some sounds like sound scratch and that's not actually sound music it is sound chunk all right so now we're going to go down here and we're going to initialize the uh, SDL mixer so what we're going to do is if mix audio mix open audio uh, frequency I like to do for 44100 because that's what one I, I learned to use so that's what I'll use uh, mix default format two channels for both music and sound you can add more channels but I use two because you only need music and sound and the chunk size it will be 240 2048 sorry and then in that well at the very end of this at less than zero if it's less than zero then it returns an error so we'll have it just print out a uh, SDL mixer error and then we'll have our code there and SDL get error so that way it just outputs the error whenever we mix audio it gives us less than zero when it returns it now we're going to open up the music so music music equals mix load muse music whatever you want to call it and this music file is beat.wave and if music file is still null that means it didn't load at all so what we're going to do is just I'll put a, uh, a message we'll, instead of saying this one we'll just say uh, couldn't load beat.wave and we're gonna have the escape code and instead of SDL get error it is mix get error so it's gonna do basically the same thing for loading sounds so sound scratch instead of load muse it's load wave and the uh, file name is scratch and we're gonna copy and paste these around sound scratch so sound scratch is not initialized, couldn't load it. Okay. And now we now that we've loaded the sounds, we also have to play them. So since we have the code from the last video, you're going to add a few more clauses here or cases. So case SDL K let's do one. We do mix play channel. 
negative one because we don't want it to loop or something. Uh, sound scratch and zero and do a break so that basically it plays the sound scratch whenever we hit uh, the key one over the Q button alright now we're gonna make it so it uh it plays music whenever we click the mouse and either it plays it or it stops it so right here mouse button down whoops and we whenever we have it doing mouse button down we're going to check to see if the music is playing or not so mix playing music equals zero there's that one music channel so it, it, it um it checks to see on there that's why we have two channels one for music one for sound so if it's not playing music then we make it play music so play music 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 uh, negative one because it's gonna loop forever so now under here if it is if it is looping music then it, we're gonna check to see if it's paused or not if paused music equals one which means if it is mix resume music and if it is not paused then we pause it pause pause music here we go so everything there should be good now what we need to do is just clean up whenever or when it unloads the uh, the program so we're going to do mix free music and the music music file and we're also going to set the uh, the variable to null so it can clean up from the C side of things then we're going to do mix uh, not mic mix free chunk sound scratch and sound scratch equal null and then after we've cleaned up everything now we can use the uh, mix quit to close off every, oh, everything in there and if we try this out do the build and run we see our things from last time and now it's playing music where we click the mouse and if we hit the one key, it makes a scratch sound. And you can also do them at the same time. So yeah, that will conclude this tutorial. See you next time for the next part. Goodbye.